set fire to the wagon and run it down on the house. I'll cover you. like our trick worked. They're sure leaving. When the wagons turned over, we had to clear out. That's great. A few more mistakes like this, we might as well let the farmers know what we're after. What are you so worried about? No one knows there's oil under that land except us. No, but they might. That's why we've got to get possession before anybody finds out. The only way to do that is to scare those farmers into selling. Yeah, we're doing all right until that Howard guy showed up. I wonder how he knew about the raid in time to warn the farmers. The information must have come from one of the raiders. Not a chance. My men are all okay. Even the new one you took on yesterday? Yes, even him. Well, keep an eye on him anyway. Just to be on the safe side, you'd better move your outfit over to Echo Cave. All right, but I still think we ought to do something about that Howard guy. I'll do the thinking around here. And right now, it's much wiser just to watch every move he makes. I want to know what he's doing all the time. I'll send a couple of men over to the Bolton place to keep an eye on him. All we know is that Lawton's their leader. But who's behind him, and what's the reason for all this violence and terrorism? Well, honey, if we had the answer to those questions, we wouldn't have to be cleaning these firearms now. Sometimes it all seems so useless. You're worried about Steve, aren't you? Yes, and about you, too. Suppose someone should accidentally discover that Mr. Howard is really the notorious Jesse James. Now, we'll worry about that when the time comes. In the meantime, it's more important to keep an eye on the Raiders' hideout. Steve might have some important information for us. When do we start? Right now. Two boat. Echo Cave. You. Help Trent round up the horses. Never mind the other step. I thought I told you to help with the horses. I'm in no hurry, Lawton. Well, I am. In this outfit, you take orders from me or else. Or else I go my way. Nobody's going anyplace until I find out how that Wilkie deal got fouled up. This gun handle's not easy, Lawton. And I don't like to use it on any of my friends. Forget it. I must have lost my temper. It seems deserted. Sure does. Let's take a look around.
You're right. There doesn't seem to be anyone around. They must be coming back because they left some of their stuff. I wonder where they went. Wait a minute. Here's something. Steve and I used cars to send code messages when we were in the Army. The torn ace of spades always indicated trouble. Then Steve must be in trouble. See these marks? When the cards are arranged in suits and stacked, they should tell us something. I'm going to see what made that rabbit jump. Meantime, you stay here and sort these in suits. All right. the sheriff. Over by that tree. Keep in cover, Dan. to go after the other one. Besides, the message on these cards is probably more important. Echo Cave. That's where they must have gone. And that's where I'm going. In the meantime, you get the sheriff and his deputies and come to Echo Cave. Let's get to our horses. did tell me much about that outfit you were with down in Texas. There's a lot I don't know about you either. So that should make it kind of even. That sharp tongue of yours is going to get you in a lot of trouble some of these days. Howard caught us at the camp. I managed to get away. What'd you come here for? You might have been followed. Don't worry. Don't worry. I was in the clear. Besides, he seemed to be more interested in some cards laying around than anything else. Cards, huh? Stand watch outside. I, uh, kind of misplaced my gun. Misplaced it? All right, what'd you do with that deck of cards? You're jumping at conclusions again, Lawton. Am I? We'll see about that. Sit down. heading this way. Yeah? No. I got a better idea. 
going to give you a chance to prove that I'm all wrong about you. Give me that gun. Going to leave one shell in this gun. When Howard steps through that entrance, shoot to kill. There'll be curtains for both of you. Get over there.